Today we're going to show Vicon's virtual matrix controller, the VMDC. We have it set up here with four monitors on our video wall. And as you can see, we have those monitors set up on our display to represent them as they look on the wall. To start a camera, the user can grab the camera from the list and move his mouse to the monitor he wants the video to start on. He can also grab the camera and drop it right on the monitor icon on his screen. Notice that the spot window always shows the camera on the selected monitor, the one circled with a red frame, and it allows the user to move them around, always have a view on any monitor he wants to, or also to bring it up to full screen or make it go away completely. The same window can be used for PTZ control. If the operator brings up the PTZ camera, the controls will show up and allow him to drive the camera. VMDC allows changing each monitor's display layout. For example, let's change the top left monitor into a quad view. And we can change our top right monitor into a 64-way split and add more cameras to it. Depending on the cameras you use and the monitors you have, you can display HD images easily. The maximum number of cameras a VMDC can display will depend on the camera's resolution, frame rate, and compression. The higher those are, the less cameras the VMDC will be able to display. For that, we can add more and more VMDCs and have the main VMDC control them and allow increasing the total processing power. Macros can be set up to run on command, on alarm, or on a schedule. Note that the macros are represented differently for the operator in order for him to know the difference on the displayed monitor. VMDC can be used in local Viconet mode as well, like a regular workstation. The operator will primarily use his mouse. The monitors will still be active, and he can use the local screen to bring up cameras. Of course, the total number of cameras, like before, depends on the total machine's capabilities. Typically, in large systems, when the operator has multiple monitors to control, this mode will not be used. A unique feature in this mode is the ability to call up a camera more than once and zoom in to different locations in the same view. The same camera can now be used and we can zoom in in the back here while we zoom in to the front here. This can be done for live images as well as recorded ones. This can be an extremely powerful tool when using the system for forensic purposes. VMDC allows us to play back any video recorded by the system. It will provide us with a playback mark and a timestamp. We can also play back on the monitors In this case, the operator will get an indication that playback is now being presented on that tile. The spot window will allow him to digitally zoom into the played back images. VMDC can be controlled and operated from a keypad or from PLC devices such as touchscreens over serial or IP communication. For conclusion, VMDC is a powerful and flexible tool for multi-monitor displays. It can be designed to use on small local display systems or very large city-wide seaport airport systems. For more information about VMDC and the other Viconet products, please visit our website at vicon-security.com.